Wasn't perfect, but the Browns are up 14 to 7. You can tell now that how the injuries have affected the Browns here, but they got the lead. Joe Flacco has been very good in this game. For him to be throwing over 200 yards, as my son and I were saying, is just remarkable at this point. It really is remarkable how well Joe Flacco is playing. The defense has done a great job. The only turn, the only touchdown was off a turnover by Cooper. I felt bad for Cooper. Again, he hasn't been here all week, so the practices, and you can tell he's a little rusty in that play. He's trying to switch the ball over to the other hand. That happens. Defense is playing great. Offense is doing what they can. Uh, Hudson's not having his best game. Run the ball. Um, in this game, I'll be fair right now, I haven't really felt that so far, actually. I'm okay with what the Browns are doing. I, I do think they should run the ball a little bit more. But And Joku's having a great day. Grant Delpit's having a great day. Martin Emerson. Martin Emerson's having a career day. David Njoku's playing great. I agree with you. The uh, Cooper fumble. I mean, it was. It was a dagger. Cooper's done so many good things this year. You could tell he felt terrible in that play. That's an... It, and You kind of just move on from that kind of play. You don't really get it too much. And Joku back finally. I agree with you. Flacco's been playing good. Uh, the interception by Flacco on Tillman was Tillman's fault. Um, actually, it's more of a good defensive play by the Jaguars. They knocked Tillman off his route. Tillman's got a break through that play. Um, wasn't Flacco, actually. That Flacco was anticipating Tillman being there. Clean up the penalties. Boy, Hudson is having a... Again, when you're down to your fifth tackle, this is what you get. Hudson's really having a rough time in this game. And Joku got my money. We use, use Ford more. I agree with you about that, LV Browns. Good to see you. Charlie, yes. But again, when you have injuries and you have second and third and fourth, even fifth stringers, this is what happens. The Browns are really banged up. They're doing what they can in this game. Uh, I can't get upset at this score. It's 14-7. They're doing a good job. This is not like last week where I thought mental errors and bad decisions caused them to lose. Right now, I'm seeing a team that's doing what they can. I mean, the Browns aren't perfect. Hudson is really struggling, but again, he's a fifth stringer. I don't know. Hodge is back in the land. Yes, Flacco. Flacco's really playing great in this game. I cannot say anything more than that. Uh, this is rough. Should be 14. Yes, Jared. Cooper made a bad error. He's been injured. His timing is off. That's a very erratic, unusual play from Cooper. I can't get mad. It is a bad play. There you go. If Cooper doesn't fumble, Callan agree with you about that. Um, so what do we need to do in the second half? Try to run the ball. They actually, and they need, they need to control the clock. Browns need to control the clock. Shrink the game down. This game's going too long. The longer it goes, the more it favors Jacksonville. Put pressure on Lawrence. Um, don't agree in the half. I can understand that. I would have loved to run the ball there once. There's mistakes that D has right there. I agree with you. Too many fouls. Too many fouls is right. I agree with you about that. Why punt that away at the end of the half? Cam, if you don't get it there, you give a chance for Jacksonville to kick a field goal. I thought that was the right call, actually. Hopefully the snap time works the second half. I agree with you. Uh, second half, shut out, please. Too much anxiety. D Blair, that'd be great. Hope you're having a great holiday run, D Blair. Only 14 points. I, I Jeffrey, I'm I, I, look, I would love to be up 14 nothing. Maybe even 17 nothing. But 14 nothing is probably about right. Martin Emerson, great half. Flacco, great half. This the one interception in Tillman was on was on Tillman. He didn't finish the route. He got knocked off his route. Cooper, terrible fumble. He you, you give him a mulligan. Cooper's been great all year. It's hard to get too mad at the guy. There we go. All right. Ravens down at half. That was good to see. Let's go, Browns. Robin Ann, I agree with you about that. Let's take a break. Gulp some alcohol. Gulp some water. Come back here after the game again. For what the Browns are going through injury-wise, 14-7 is about right. Um, you feel pretty good. And Flacco, along with Emerson and Delpit, have been playing so well. And Joku should be 21 nothing. Cato, I, I, you're right. I think 17 nothing. But, again, they had some turnovers. Tillman getting knocked off his route was bad. Um, and Cooper made a bad fumble. He tried to exchange it in the left hand, and that was that. But they got some turnovers back, too. Emerson made a great play. So 14-7, here we are. Stefanski, the most inconsistent play caller in the NFL. Ray, I agree with you. Um, I would actually tell you so far, he's not upset me so far. I think it's been okay with the play calling. I really do. I think the play calling has been okay. All right. 24 to win. I think 21, DW Guild. I think 21. They got to get one more touchdown in this game. You might be right, though. They've got to put as much pressure on Lawrence as possible. As much. Uh, Peterson loves to throw. 
Tackles need to stop the penalties, yes. And this is what happens when you get a fourth, fifth string. Hudson's having a rough day. Hudson is false starting almost every play. <laughs> I mean, he really is. If you watch the game, Hudson could have had three or four more false starts in this game. Halftime we go. See it after the game. Go Browns!